Today is obviously in part makes us reflect on the fire going back to February 2015. I think the, the most remarkable thing about that time was straight after the fire, the way everyone turned their hand to whatever needed to be done. People grabbed tasks that needed to be done. They may have been nothing to do with their day jobs, but they were what was required after the fire. So the team's responsiveness to the situation was remarkable. The new Dowdy facility is arguably the most advanced uh, modern propeller manufacturing facility in the world. And it gives us an opportunity to consolidate a number of functions that are presently resident in different locations here in Gloucester. By bringing everybody into one room, it's uh, more of a one Dowdy team working on propellers to advance, advance the art than satisfy our customers. It was certainly an honor to present a Dowdy with the U.S. flag uh, that was flown on the C-130J aircraft. Uh, it was a pleasure to present the flag to uh, Dowdy because it certainly signifies you know, their commitment and support to the U.S. Air Force and many of our customers across the globe. It was amazing to see how they quickly turned around and recovered from this uh, what would be considered a devastating incident. I'm really happy to say that the Dowdy team, the de Havilland team, uh, worked very well together. Uh, we worked uh, to secure blades for our customers, making sure aircraft uh, remain flying, and truly a partnership. All of the employees of uh, Dowdy Propellers should be quite proud of the fact that they have this brand new facility to set the journey forward for Dowdy Propellers into the future. This new facility here is, gives us the opportunity to build upon our development techniques with manufacturing, with manufacturing techniques, with new design techniques, such that we can develop our products at the right cost and with the right level of performance for the customers. So coming out of this new facility, we're going to have the very best product in terms of the design, in terms of its manufacture, and ultimately in terms of its support for our customers. So the opening of the site today is, is a milestone for us, uh, and it's a big deal to us. We've been spending at GE Aviation a tremendous amount of time and resources driving lean manufacturing through all of our shops. And this is the first time that we've been able to work with really a, a blank slate and be able to take the MRO piece of our business and the new make piece of our business and combine those lean lines together under one rooftop. It's a big deal. We're gonna prove out a lot of the concepts and we'll be able to leverage the things that we learn here to the rest of our shops within GE Aviation.